Hello everyone, this is uh, Game Scouts. Today we're going to be playing the Yogg. Uh, I'm Chris. This is Max. And RJ. And Lincoln. Lincoln doesn't want to be heard. No. I'm Austin. <laughs> okay. Lincoln is a bad boy and he spilled all the chocolate milk and now he's in chains. Okay, well, no, we're going we're to start this. Uh, I'm going to be green. I want to be orange. Um, ooh, I'll be yellow. Okay. I'll be blue. Okay. I want to be red. <laughs> You're gonna be red. <laughs> and Austin's gonna be red. Austin's gonna be red. She has Poofy. we. She has weird cheeks. Well, she probably just does this. Shut up. Hey, the yog will be here in six weeks, and no one expects it. Not a one of us. We just keep on living this our lives. This is a cool story, huh? Week by week. This is a really cool story, huh? Shut up. It is a really cool story. I'm gonna choke you. Why? Ooh. I'm gonna go to the gardens. Wait. So how's this game work, Chris? And yeah. landscape. Basically, uh, you got your stats up in wow, the you made a giraffe. Uh, corner there. <laughs> and then the uh, for each person, wow. there's a different color tab. Yeah. And you each week you go to a different place, spend the week there. Uh, you get some stats up or stats down, mm. and then uh, a random thing happens that yeah. will progress the story. It's really cool. So it's like Kirby Air Ride. Wow! Sounds exactly. Exactly. Like exactly. Kirby That's Kirby. Okay. Okay. you guys. Okay. It's sad because it's kind of. So true. let's see what we'll see what happens to RJ. You spend the week maintaining the plants in the royal garden. You made a giraffe. You, yeah. You gain one finesse, one physique, and earn yourself one wealth. Yay! Very sexy. Yay. One day you come across an elderly man snoozing on the grass. You should fuck him up with the you shears. You there, young person. <laughs> with the test. He waves you over. I'm having an awful time trying to snap in the bright sun. Could you come here with your shears? Can you come here with your shears and take Do away my uh, my vision for me? Giving me some shade. <laughs> this old Eternal man is like, darkness. This old Shit. man is like super lazy. He doesn't want to like go. Over okay, the when tree you block the sun, do you just stand there for Dude, a while? Wait, isn't he yeah, in the middle of the garden, garden him, just like, like full yeah. of trees? Yeah. yeah. Well, you can either block the sun or decline. I'm gonna decline. Okay. The old man seems pretty creepy, so you mutter something about having an appointment and excuse yourself. You just avoid being raped. Ten stars. You feel good about avoiding interaction with the elderly. <laughs> <laughs> you gain one charm. How close? One charm. <laughs> you feel good. <laughs> Man. Okay, I'm gonna go to uh, the slums. Dude, Chris, how'd you get over And so fight fast? some crimes. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you spend the week uh, outsmarting and beating up criminals. You gain one mind, one physique, and one finesse. One day, while wandering the slums, you notice that the stones under used to line the road seem to have a certain pattern to them. You don't manage to figure out the myster uh, mystery, but you feel pretty smart for noticing the pattern of the tiles. You gain one mind. Oh, look at the pool. That's it. There you go, Red. It looks like, looks like a bunch of rocks. Just give me that. Give me that pass. You're not a, you're not, you're not like a color. Bad. But the boy don't get a character. <laughs> I don't get a what do I get a character? You can play next time. We whenever we actually do stuff, because this is kind of a learning experience. Well, yep, this but, is a learning experience. But I'm going to go to the palace. The okay, so you're going to do some... I'm going to attend the ball, <laughs> because, because I'm a pretty, pretty princess. Because you are a fancy gentleman. You are no. pretty, pretty. <laughs> you are pretty, pretty. It's because uh, I, <laughs> I have a... I have a new perfume. It makes oh. my cooch smell amazing, and the, the <laughs> men just flock to me. Is it, it's poison. Is it the cologne? If they touch it, they'll die. <laughs> and I'll steal their money. Is it the cologne vulva? Maybe. That, that smells like women, uh, uh, female fragrance. Can you press yes, your gloves. It's, that's a real thing. Your incredibly way. long gloves do not match your Can outfit. You spend no, the week don't. attending fancy oh, get. Why is it a whole week? Here. Because you're doing you a week. You gain two charisma and one fitness or finesse. finesse. <laughs> uh, one day you decide to lean up against the wall and to just take a break. Just. It rotates as you apply pressure and you stumble down instead of stairs. Yeah, oh, you gotta go. You enter a large dusty room filled with barrels. <laughs> barrels! <laughs> you found a king's famous wine cellar. You're gonna get drunk. Host a secret party. <laughs> <laughs> or keep quiet of what you saw. <laughs> Which one do you want to do? Mm. 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 Oh, you just fucked up. Oh, so you. You didn't host the party? No. No. Oh, okay, fine. Super Keeping party. a secret. Ian, just one, uh, one charm and one. You know why? Because only I know, and I'm just gonna take a whole bunch of stuff. Just right. a bunch of stuff. It's it's, it's Max's turn now. Time. Are you uh? Oh, you're green. green. No, he's, he's yellow. 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 Never mind. You can. Where would I go? I'm gonna go to the arena. The arena. Ooh. Better I'm gonna fight. Compete, compete on the fight. 
You spend your week fighting brutes at the arena. You gain two physique and one finesse. Yeah. <laughs> you t you tend to <clears throat> While you wandering around the hall sense. between matches, you spot a former lover, Kelly. <gasps> oh, Kelly. An awkward exchange happens in which you want to know how they are doing without s seeming to care too much. He's like, he's like walking down the halls. He's like, he's like, hey, uh, uh, not that I really care, but uh, but how you been? Because uh, I really miss you. <laughs> <laughs> Did I mention I don't care? Did I mention that I don't really care? <laughs> Kelly, why did you leave me? Can, can we just? Can Is we it just, because my bo? After after a few was. minutes, it was Gene, one of the most popular uh, fighters in the arena. Butts into the conversation. I don't think this tastes Hey, Kelly. Cool. Sorry for uh, no, sorry to interrupt, but we've got to uh, leave right away if you want to make it to your mother uh, mother's in time. <gasps> He's dating <gasps> Kelly. Oh no! <clears throat> you say in an awkward goodbye and walk off holding hands. How do you feel? Extremely jealous, dude. Extremely, extremely jealous, jealous or happy? You for should her. just take like run up to her and just plow her. Yeah, that's the can third option. Can we just can we just look <laughs> at just his surprise stance? her? Yeah, and she'll look at his, swoon. Look at his stance. Dude, look at his stance with his little tiny dagger. It just means he's. I mean, she might pass out from red flags. She dude, might pass out. What's one of those things called? Stretch. You know what? Stretch. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna say that I'm happy for Kelly. You're happy for Kelly? Yeah. Mm. It feels good. Bo uh, <clears throat> both have moved on. This encounter, despite its awkwardness, was refreshing. Ooh. Ooh. One charm. One charm. Oh. Good job. They say that the last time it came, the Yog devoured houses whole, stole lives, tore families and family members apart. But that was so very long ago. Don't you love the narrator of this game? <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah he's very uh, he's blue. I'm blue. Sorry, dude. Alright. Yeah. Let's see. I'm gonna go get drunk. You can. You can drink all week. You could actually just bartend for no apparent reason. <laughs> you spend the entire week getting wasted. Perfect. Oh, you lush. gain, How do you gain two physique? charm and one physique because drinking takes constitution. Yeah. Beer belly, bro. <laughs> But one, that's the opposite. One care. day while in the tavern, a heated argument erupts between two patrons. Soon enough, fists are flying and everybody seems to be joining in on the violence. Mm. You should join the fray because that's badass. You, there should be an option to pull out your phone <laughs> and start recording. That's what I would do. You jump on top of the table and yell, <laughs> and yell a plea to the patrons to stop all the violence. Before you know it, everybody has calmed down and chatting to one another like nothing ever happened. That always happens when I scream to one side. Thanks for that! <laughs> oh, you got money from that! <laughs> Says the bartender you while charge. slipping your, your small sack of coins. What? What? It is saying I am a small sack of coins. Yeah. You are a small sack of coins. He's giving you a small sack of coins. Yeah. It says you. You're it it says you're with as in you. You are. Oh, oh yeah. 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 There's 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 some mistakes in oh, like the stuff. The Slipping. The it's it's very it's very indie. We should definitely like, email weird. them and yeah. let them know. Uh, who's green? Uh, I'm going oh, to send them an email saying you're red, Austin. <laughs> you're not green. I forgot green went first. What we'll do is say we're people interested in buying their game, and then we'll just call them which facts and we'll tell them that they don't know how to spell your. I'm gonna bet on a fight. Placing your bets on favorite those, fighters. I gained one. Oh, I only gained one. Those are just exclamation points. One day, while wandering the halls, one of the arena's fighters approaches you. Excuse me, sir. I need a sparring partner. He says. Are you down for a fight or two? Uh, <laughs> DTF. Did you you fight crime? Determine. It yeah, can but be, you might fight two ways. crime. Two ways. Two ways. You just yeah. Like down to fuck or down to fight. Um, hmm? I'm gonna refer him to the burly guy the next first to me. One. Thanks, he says. Later on, you see two of them taking turns punching each other in the face. <laughs> Preferring not to, uh, not being punched in the face, you feel you made the decision a good decision. Good. Yeah. One mind. You gained one mind. Good job. That's I crazy. get the feeling you would have gained one physique for fighting. <sighs> or two. Uh, that's if you if you win. And I didn't. I don't think that I had enough physique to do it. I keep remembering the the fan for this is louder than anything else. Yeah. Don't turn it on. Oh my god. Turn it off. Turn it off. <laughs> Just to hear it. Um, I think I'm gonna go to the hospital and <laughs> kill some kids with cancer on accident. You can't. You can tend to patients or clean up. Oh, well, there you I'm go. Diagnosing. I think I'm gonna get polio on accident. 
Just a little bit well, of polio. There's some stuff you that spend the week the diagnosing and tending the sick. To the sick. You gain one mind and everyone well. Two mind. One day you hear a spooky sound echoing through the hospital. It must be ghost with axes. No, it is axe ghost. Yeah. <laughs> Soon afterwards, a glowing blue ghost floats. I knew it. Yeah. Crazy. No, I don't now see it. Now from the ceiling. No, the yeah, axis. there's no axes. It seems to be wandering the halls aimlessly, howling a horrible noise. Hey, anybody see my, uh, you know? She doesn't seem to know what she's freaking out of. See my bracket ball and it's lost it, bounced in the hallway. You're really bad at reading. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she didn't say anything. She of doesn't that. appear to realize that she is freaking out everyone. Oh, wait, freaking went out. I read that backwards. <laughs> you decide to do something about it. Uh, you talk to com the ghost. Vaporize, Vaporize the ghost with <laughs> magic. Or you can calmly talk to the ghost. Vaporize. I've never actually seen either of them. You explain the effect she's having on the sick. She seems to understand what you're telling her and apologize for just bothering everyone. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm a piece of <laughs> shit ghost. <laughs> she walks through a wall and is never seen again. Jesus. I guess she must Dude, have moved on. She's like yeah. everybody. Maybe you got a sack of coins. Three yeah, sack of coins for no doctors. apparent reason. Why no, would the he doctor? Answer, the it's doctor for helping everyone. Yeah. Thanks for uh, giving us ghost advice. That's stupid. Ghost advice. You just gained too well for talking to a ghost. You should get more mind or something. <laughs> he got mine. More mind. Oh, he? he got mine for attending to the second. Right. Oh yeah, the second. There we go. You just get well. Nobody's been to the forest yet. Now she gets some uh, charisma for. You want to hunt or chop wood? Get some Ooh. charm for chopping. You should chop ghost. wood with that pompadour. Or you should hunt. No, with you that should pompadour. hunt with that pompadour. You should definitely hunt with that pompadour. Dude, you look what? Defenseless critters? I don't monster. I don't want to. I don't want to try to defenseless. You're a monster. You're a monster. We'll fight back. Your monster. All right. You look like the guy who I got get, on the woods I gained two finesse stuff. and sell pelts for one month. One day you stumble upon a gigantic moss covered stone. It pulses with magical energy. Whoa, whoa, what do you do? Touch it. Touch it or leave um, it. It's, it's pulsating. It. It's pulsating. Touch it. Duh. Touch it. Touch it. You lay your hands on the enormous object. It was enormous? The stone magically, uh, magical energy shoots out of your ish into your body. You gain one magic. It was, magic it was on us in a heartbeat, or so the stories go. The earth shook. The air went still. You can actually, like, read the dots. It's good, yeah. Yeah, the ellipses. No one's yeah. been to the slums yet. Sergeant. Hey, yeah, he went to the slums, he beat up all yeah. the kids. You beat the kids up? Mm -hmm. It's funny, you can either fight crime, or you can pickpocket people in the slums. Oh, is that on You beat up potion? kids? Yeah. You spend the week experimenting with different potion brews. Yes. Sure we do this. You gain two magic and one mind. <gasps> one day, while in the tower, one of the alchemists asks you to watch his potion while he's out. I'll see what he has to watch a fucking potion, but... Soon after he leaves, the potion begins bubbling out of control. If you don't do something soon, it'll explode. Apparently you know that. Yeah. Drink, drink it. it. Drink, it. Yeah. drink it. Drink it. Drink it or throw it out the window. Dude, drink it. Drink it, pussy. YOLO. Both of them seem incredibly dangerous. Drink it, pussy. Drink it, pussy. You guys are mean. Don't give it to Pierre Pressure. Pierre Pressure. I wanted to drink it in the first place. Well, then drink it. Duh. It's okay. You quickly drink the potion. The st your stomach acids seem to have quelled the potion's fury. <laughs> you gain two magic. Nice. Why would, that that mean, why would that ever be a good idea? Just magic. like this... Bubbling chemical seems to be out of control. <laughs> uh, it's a magical bubbling chemical. Down the hatch. Yeah, have you ever wondered? YOLO. Oh. Have, have you ever I am an incredibly great. powerful wizard. It was great flavored. I'm going to meditate for a little bit. Orange? What? That's what I'm you spend the week potion. in <laughs> deep meditation. He drank a bunch of... You gain one magic and two mind. You look like one a day a toothless old woman approaches you. I have a small pouch of magic beans. Would you be interested in purchasing them? Of course I would. You only have one mo. Yeah. That was all your money. Okay. He's like Jack and the Dead. Later, you decide to plant all uh, plant them in small, rarely visited parts of the garden. Oh, good job. What's? what's uh, it's, uh, uh, it's red. Oh. There you go. Austin. Can you can you continue? Can you go back to the garden? Oh yeah, no, I'm gonna meditate. Then. I should have done. Oh okay. What? By the way, I figured out uh, every stat that you get from every place in here. <laughs> so why? I'm gonna chop wood because in my fancy wedding dress. I, I bought this and then 
was like so enthralled by it that I played it for three hours afterwards. By yourself. Where by should, myself, yeah. What should I? Uh, this one. Definitely just chocolate. Which one? Chocolate or hunt? It doesn't matter. Uh -huh. I want you guys to experience hunting. this for the first time. With, you okay. spend the week hunting defenseless creatures. You did. They must Critters. have been Critters. just like crows Critters. and like Critters. disabled rabbits. Oh yeah. No. You gain two finesse and sell the belts for one wealth. Why were they disabled? One night, uh, through the trees, by a be? group of cloaked figures all standing in a circle. They are chanting in unison. Headshots. Oh mighty lord of the night, master of beasts, <laughs> bring uh, the bringer, bringer of pain, pain. or uh, derision. He can't read ERs. <laughs> and one of them runs out from the darkness towards the rest of the group. Sorry everyone, but I was reading this uh, <laughs> calendar wrong, he says. We were supposed to summon the demon yesterday. Oh, that, gets, <laughs> that kind of gets it away. And now we have to wait a whole year to try again. <laughs> There's a collective <laughs> sigh as the group oh, dispersed. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you learn a bit about demon summoning. That's it. You, you gain one mind and one magic. <laughs> That's it's hilarious. funny if you. Yeah, funny. Uh, <laughs> well, darn it. <laughs> Okay. If you if you go into the forest and get that um, <clears throat> earlier in the game, then they actually do something with you. That's no, fine. He's just he's just the demon sitting there with this his little suitcase. He's looking up looking up at the top of hell. He's going, huh? Oh, here they are they gonna go? Are they gonna do this? He's like waiting at the airport. He's just like yeah. He's like just waiting at the airport. They must have got oh, like stuck. Man. The All plane right. left without me. <laughs> yeah, he's like, oh, I knew they weren't gonna come, and he just leaves. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, you know what? I'm gonna go to the palace. Okay. Do, you, uh, do administration uh, work. Do or? some administration work. Oh man. You uh, spend the week doing some work. paperwork for the palace. Yeah. Palace paperwork. Yeah, at least you're gonna a decent one. You are paid two wealth and gain one mine. <clears throat> one day oh. you accidentally bump Sorry into. Sorry about the mouse. Yes. There you go. Watch where you're going, filthy peasant. Burner, burner, burner. A duke sound. A duke sounds like a dick. <clears throat> he shoves you out of the way with his hand and continues walking. You gonna be passive aggressive or active aggressive? Hmm. Mm. I can only be aggressive. I want to see yeah. what active is. I want to see what their definition. I think you like passive aggressive. aggressive because of the ascot that you always yeah. wear. Dude, you do look like the guy who just like flip the shit out. See, of I'm sorry, <laughs> just don't, don't punch me directly in the face. You have to well, look color more. I went and I thought. I came back and I caught, killed some animals for fun. Mm -hmm. You and are pretty. And now I'm super magic, mm -hmm. so I'm definitely gonna do that. <laughs> Shove him back. He stumbles slightly. That was kind of lame. Oh, <laughs> it was one charm, you dick. It's okay. I'm still sexy. <laughs> and then the world was a howling fury, chaos, screaming, the sound of all we knew being pulled in half. Man, did they get George Clooney? Turn off those lights. What are you talking about, Chris? The lights on my controller. Ah. Yeah. Um. Uh. I'm gonna go. You can go pick up, pocket some people. You should go. No, pick I'm cotton. not gonna pick. I'm not gonna go. Let's get better. Let's get better. I'm gonna go to the palace. Speech. <laughs> the the ball. She looks drunk as fuck. She has these weird hat things. Yeah, yeah she you got like little cat ear things. They're cool. They're cute. You spend the week attending fancy gatherings. You gain two charm and one finesse. One day, you hear somebody shouting somebody something in the hallway. Oh shit! Just yelling at someone. Like There's a bomb in the palace. Oh fuck! They scream. <laughs> There's a mass panic as people try desperately to escape the palace's walls. Well, they should use the door. Do you want to locate and disarm the bomb or run away? Hmm. What Will is I my die? mind? Mm, your, mind, your mind is six, mind is six yeah, I but see, your I magic is nine. As, yeah, I'm gonna lo I'm gonna try and locate and blah. You run deeper into the castle, trying to figure out where the explosives are hidden. You manage to find them in the wine cellar, disguised as barrels of wine. <laughs> the bomb appears to be on a detonator that is controlled by a powerful magic. Ooh, eat it. Using your arcane knowledge, you quickly manage to figure out how the bomb works. And take the detonator apart cautiously. Yay. You Yay. save the palace. Yay. The king rewards you handsomely. Yay. You, you earn three wealth. Gave you three nice. wealth. Yeah. Your reputation increases. Okay. You also earn get three charm. Three charm. Oh yeah. Nice. Yeah. Um, if if you if you either uh, choose the other one or you uh, don't have enough magic to disarm it, then the palace is destroyed and you can't go there anymore. Do you die though? 
No, you don't die. You run out of the house. What if you go and If you, you go and search for it, then you run out of the house just in time. So. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm so thanks for it. ruining it for us. You're that's a square. Square. It's not really this. much of a spoiler. No, it's not. Oh. Uh, I'm going <laughs> to meditate again. Uh, I gain one magic and two mind. And you become more square. Yep. <laughs> Walking past a mound one day, you see a little fat frog sitting on a lily pad. Please, sir, the frog begins. I am not a frog at all. But an enchanted prince. Kiss me. Kiss me. <laughs> if you could see your way to kissing me, it would break the curse and return me to normal. You just sit on him. Uh, I'm just totally gonna kiss the frog. Oh. You you bend down and kiss the frog. You feel a curious stirring, like a curse is trying to break. Unfortunately, you don't seem to be magical enough to get the job done. Kiss him. The frog thanks you for your efforts, efforts, and hops off sadly. <laughs> Put your balls on his face. <laughs> it wasn't magical. We, we, you wake up the next morning with a bad case of lip warts. When, jerk, when you, uh, when you when lose one your nuts, my nuts like cross your face and make you feel better? <laughs> <laughs> you know I want to check what you guys have. You oh, just pull it up. Okay. Uh, I've been wondering how. what button did you press to do that? Uh, you just push over. Push over. Huh? Push like over. Right. Because up and down choose places. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't really matter what everyone else has. It's You're working on your own stuff. I don't want to listen. We just have all day. I haven't been to the. It's only week four. I yeah. don't know how many weeks there uh, are. There are six. Oh. And then there's one final week. Clean the lab. You should definitely clean the lab. Clean the lab. <laughs> it's been Dude. Playing the noxious chemicals. You paid one wealth. One day, the Nakamas decided to take a break from work and instead throw a cantrip party. Woo! <laughs> yeah. Get some cantrips. Press the digitation. Your pretty okay. One alchemist waves his hand and produces a confetti in front of him. Another spawns a seemingly endless number of dubs from his sleeve. <laughs> then all the alchemists turn to you and see what you come up with. You want to uh, do a simple trick or a complex one? Pick your nose. Okay. Wait, uh... You, what you do you think do... I pull off? Well, okay, so, like, you, you, have, you, have, you have magic of seven, so... Do whichever one you want to do. Set no. your hair ablaze, dude. That's magical no. trick. You're bald now. <laughs> you lose your <laughs> You jerkass. Good, good job. Good awesome. Job. awesome. You lied to me. How did I lie to you? You said enough. No, I said that you had a magic of seven. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs> you're just gonna um, look up looking like our keep this. Well, I actually, I want to go to the Alchemy <laughs> Tower. Well, you can't go to the Alchemy Tower. She's a bald. Only one person. Oh no, person. I've, be, I've kind of been to these places. Uh, you haven't been to the slums. Yeah, go to the slums. Uh, yeah, go to the slums. Go slumming. But, but or I'm you can fight crime. I can fight Pots chicken pockets. You do not look like a guy who would fight crime. You look like a guy who would pick Oh. Look at him. That's yeah. Just, yeah. It's funny. Uh, everyone else gets a mask except for him. That's funny. He doesn't need a mask. Everyone knows who the fuck he is. He's too yeah. handsome You spend a, a week mask. outsmarting and beating mascot. up criminals. I think everyone knows who He's the, the fuck only is. man in town that wears an ascot. And pop color. You done? Alright. <laughs> no. <laughs> you gain one mind, one physique, and one finesse. We just look at Max. He's a pop collar and fancy hair. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Uh, one night, you hear cheering coming from an alleyway. Oh my god. Peering in, a crowd of men cheering on a dog of violently ripping a apart each other. Dog fights. Dog violence is wrong. Okay. <clears throat> That's <laughs> One of the men <laughs> spots you and asks, Oi! Would you like to participate in our little real. beaten... By the way, Sweet. He, a real dog game. fighting here? Real, real, real illegal. Cockney accent there, Max. No, totally it's, legal. It's, okay, it's you know illegal. what's really real. bad is that real. he was like... He goes, oi, would ya? And then he says, participate. Yeah, he says participate just fine. Like, well, you, you can say the participate in an accent. Like, little. Oh. How would you say little? Oi, oi, you like little. participating, little beaten guy. Oh, yeah, little just bet game. shit yeah. all that's, over my fucking... <laughs> that's, that's how you do it. Yeah. <laughs> that's the Cockney accent there. You want to bet on dog fights? I'm going to try to stop it because you yeah, know what? Bit. I've been fighting crime. You try to... <laughs> Dog fighting? <laughs> just get some posters. <laughs> very quickly get very angry with you. I wonder why. One of them walks up to you and oh, pulls out a knife. Shit, he tries to slash you, but your reflexes allow you to disarm him and pin him to the ground! <laughs> it's because I'm super awesome. Oh. Ooh, your assailant has chokehold out. until he passes out. You stop the town's illegal dog fighting. You feel very good about yourself right now. Yay. One physique, one finesse. One mine and one charm. Fuck! And one magic. Why not? Magic. Because I'm, magic? you know, because I'm super magic. Because the dogs are magic and they're like, here's our magical powers! When it arrives this time, how will we fare? Will we once more rebuild, move on, be strong? Or have we forgotten? 
Yeah, the narration's strong, but the handwriting guy was kind of lacking. <laughs> <laughs> I love the uh, too cool. many, too many, too many dots. Too many dots. Okay, <laughs> Just for the go? sake of consistency, I'm gonna go to the alchemy tower again and do yeah, some potions. Yes. You've done this like three times. Shh. <clears throat> you spend the week experimenting with different potion brews. Shocker. You gain two magic and one mind. One day you hear cries for help coming from the next room. Running over to investigate, you see the alchemist. Another that ooze monster. Have accidentally created an ooze monster. Ooze monster. How do you dispatch the ooze? You have to punch it. Punch it. Oh, no. uh, no, blast it more... with magic. Yeah. You've got super magic. You pulverize the ooze into a puddle with an array of magical spells. The alchemists all cheer. Yay! You gain one charm. I use great pit. <laughs> I use great pit. <laughs> I use great pit. Yeah, no, you gotta use great and... spike pit several yeah. times. And then I, uh, I use great water. You spend Zuka the week in deep meditation. Again. Yeah. You gain one magic and two mind. One day, while in the gardens, you notice a bean stalk. Eat it or water it. Why would you eat a bean stalk? Because beans. Water it, dude. Yeah. It's just bean. Water it, dude. Uh, Make it grow. No, no. Uh, you might get a magic bean stalk tower to giant. No, I know what happens whenever you water oh, it. What I'm happens? not sure what happens whenever you eat it, though. Don't, don't eat, eat it. it. Eat um, it. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Eat <laughs> it. Do what you want, Chris. Don't succumb to peer pressure. You don't listen to him. Eat it. You eat pick it. the plant and bite into it. It tastes incredible. You feel energy coursing through you. You gain two physique and three magic. Wow. Yes. Well, 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 How does your magic compare to mine, though? Hmm? How does your uh, magic? It's probably less. Oh. No, we have. The mine same seems magic. to be the worst out of everyone's. But my mind is higher than yours. But your charm is uh, higher than mine. I got. Uh, uh, here you go. Fuck. Fuck you uh, you well. make bad life decisions. That's why. No, if <laughs> if you if you water the beanstalk, then a um a bean golem comes out and is like, "Oh, you freed me from my beans." Blah blah blah. The well, beanstalk only showed up because I planted the beans that I got from the yeah. one. Yeah. Well, yeah, that was obvious. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's what you guys I mean, I don't understand some. Uh, uh, what happens when I drink? You you, you want to drink or bartend? You haven't. Nobody's bartended yet, have they? This been the week serving drinks at the tavern. You earn one wealth and tips and gain two. Yours, you're just being a servant. One of your so favorite far. tellers, uh, the steps up from one of the tavern tables. Uh, she offers to read anybody's fortune for a small sum. I'm not sure you play mine. Do it, do yeah, it, dude. Do it. Seriously, yeah, exactly. yeah. you spend one well. The fortune teller takes your hand and begs, uh, showering you with promise of love and wealth. She doesn't really go into <laughs> in detail at this whole time. You can't help but feel that this is all an act. Underwhelmed, you sl uh, <laughs> slightly poor. You can't help but feel like you're wasted your money. That <laughs> night, while walking home, the fortune teller runs up to you and gives you a kiss on the cheek. What? Lesbian mm -hmm. experiences. All right. Okay. 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 Yeah, right. Let's go. There, uh, there's the love part. She says, and a toothless <laughs> smile. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> then she hands you a giant sack of gold. Wow. There's the wealth. She says, you gain two wealth. <laughs> yeah. You st still think I'm a hack? <laughs> yes. The end. That was awesome. <laughs> that was great. Okay, I got, give the, give the she, she's she, like, oh, I guess but she gives the best love. head. <laughs> oh, no teeth? Like, at least she didn't just care. look at her face like, love me. <laughs> love me. <laughs> 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 Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? You know what? I have uh, quite a bit of finesse mm -hmm. and physique. I'm just going to bring your douche collar to the forest. Yeah. Oh, do it. The forest. I'm going to compete in some more fights. Why didn't you bet? Get a you spend somebody. the week fighting brutes in the arena. You gain two physique and one finesse. During the match, uh, another warrior's weapon is, is knocked knocked from their grasp. You barely manage to avoid it. Same <clears> thing. <throat> With a, a sickingly crunch, it destroys the knee of the nearby bystander. He accuses you of causing him harm and not stopping the flying weapon. He takes you to court. <laughs> Do you want to offer a settlement or defend yourself? Um, I did nothing that was wrong. A charm. So, oh, <laughs> it's, his, charm six. it's his fault for sitting in this. Who are they gonna so. listen to? The white guy or the brown guy with the douche collar? Oh Jesus! Okay, well you have less wealth than you have Your charm. Your ass, God so. will protect you. <laughs> you settle. Uh, oh, three oh, oh, losing three wealth. Well, I guess you have zero. The yog. It's almost here. No, it's just almost. Almost. almost yeah. Almost. yeah. Do you notice that the um, around the borders the uh, like steamy stuff has been coming in? From nope. The sea? Did I not thought, notice. Yeah. Oh well, I notice it now because does the game it. end? Yeah. No. Yeah. No, this game well, goes this is, on this forever. Is, yeah, forever. This is Civ <laughs> this, this is, is the last six, actually. Yeah, this is Civ Six. You're you're building colonies. 
This is just this weird. is the longest game. In we existence. spend the week gathering fancy attending. Just oh fighting my kids. god. Attending fancy gatherings. This <laughs> <laughs> is what it actually says. <laughs> you gain two charm and one finesse. One day you overhear the jester tell a joke to a group of people. <laughs> Everyone laughs, <laughs> but you didn't understand the joke at all. Laugh anyone. Uh... Do my mind is too, too le cool. is not mindy enough. So do you want to ask for an exclamation? I'm gonna ask for an exclamation because my charm is out the ass. Okay. You approach the jester, asking what exactly the joke meant. The jester scolds you <laughs> at length <laughs> about the dangers of explaining jokes. <laughs> Something about puppies and them dying when you dissect them. That's cool. If what? You don't quite understand, but everyone around you starts laughing. Presumably, the jester had made another joke at your expense. You've begun coming to terms with the fact that your sense of humor is lacking. Being more self-aware, you manage to exude an aura of confidence. You gain one charm. Yay. That, that is hilarious. That's some bullshit. That's what retarded. You if you get laughed at by a group of people, the exact opposite should happen. <laughs> Well, maybe she's a. Uh, My penis feels up. smaller than it was before. Uh, I'm gonna go see. <laughs> I guess the that makes it me feel and better. I'm gonna brew a <laughs> you do week. not look right. Yeah, I know it's really weird. You're just like, you spend the week experimenting <laughs> with different potion brews. It's funny. Uh, <laughs> what am I even doing here? He looks. He looks really weird. Uh, anywhere else except for the arena, where he has like this battle axe in his hands and shit. It's really cool. He just doesn't look like he belongs there at all. You gain two <laughs> magic and one mind. He just looks dirty all the time. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> one day, an artificer stops for, uh, by the shop for a visit. She's adorned with magical gadgets and gizmos, and is followed everywhere by a clockwork spider. Oh, I'm not gonna get this. My charm is not matter. The alchemists of the tower all, or yeah, the alchemists of the tower all go out uh, of their way to impress the artificer. Offering her an array of potions and elixirs. As she's leaving, she adorns the most charming of the alchemists with a special trinket. The fact that she did not choose you was a very humbling experience. You gain one charm. So sorry, Chris. <laughs> it's because of those uh, mouth words. Yeah, they suck, yeah. don't they? Mm -hmm. I haven't been to the Alchemy Tower and made a potion yet. Oh, well, you can't. You can't. You can't. Tower. Tower. I already went to the Alchemy Tower. Oh. Let's just go to the forest. You should just go to the forest. You want to go to the gardens? Or maybe the hospital? You should go to the forest. You could pick up the people in the slums. What was that Stephen King book movie with the mist? Was it called The Mist? It's, it's called, called, called The Mist, mist yeah. yeah. Okay. Is that what this is? Yes. No. No. Except for in medieval you, times. One day during your forest excursions, you stumble upon a swarm of rats. Tame them. At first, oh, you jump cool. backwards in shock, but then you start to hear them con <laughs> uh, conversing with one another. It's rats. They call you over. Excuse me, miss. One of them says in a high pitch voice. <laughs> do you think do you think we might be able to help us out with something? You see, we're trying to elect a new leader. But it seems our votes are completely tied. We're trying to decide between Seed Paul and the Vengeful Blighttooth. Oh, no, on. it's Seed Paul the Vengeful and Blighttooth the Wise. Oh. I like this better because it's seems cute. Says the rat. Oh. Seed Paul steps forward. Not to if you vote for me, that. the rats will have a powerful leader, one who isn't afraid to take our fight to the enemy. Proclaim <laughs> Seed Paul. Blightooth steps up. If you vote for me, <laughs> goodness, I will lead these rats to an age of enlightenment. <laughs> says Blighttooth. Which rat do you choose? Uh. Seed Paul or Blighttooth? Seed Blight. Blightpaw. Blightpaw. <laughs> that actually sounds cool. <laughs> Blight Paul the Which Vengewise one did you choose? Well, see, uh, It was Blight Tooth okay. See Paul bows his head and walks back into the, the mass of rats Blight Tooth grooms up your shoulder And whispers ancient secrets into your ears <laughs> Thanks One mind and one magic Yay Your mind, is, your mind is blown you're, uh... Whoa ancient secrets from rats <laughs> yeah. Your stats are so balanced Austin I know They're all zero they're, No they're all <laughs> really balanced There's nothing that's too high well, there's... I'm gonna go fight some more crime, because I'm, I'm cool like that. Oh, yeah. You sp spend a week at, uh, outsmarting and beating up criminals. You gain one mind, one physique, and one finesse. I'm, like, super normal. Oh, shit. oh that's creepy. <clears throat> well, it's yeah, a good it's thing cool. that this is the last week. One night, uh, you hear a woman whisper at you from nearby. Hey, you, she calls out. Uh, looking to make a bit of coin. You mean bitcoins? <laughs> she wants you to sell your body. <laughs> you want some you coin? You shouldn't or? trust no, her. Thanks. Um... You know what? Uh, 
Uh, yeah, you're kind of broke. She bro. might be a funky sex oh, customer. So you, you might want to watch out. She's, uh, so I, I decided to pick the coin. All right. She signals for you to walk in the alleyway with her. Come closer, she says, and nobody else can hear what I'm about to tell you. No, it's just Please closer, me. eager to hear. <laughs> <laughs> you'll be, you'll you're be earning, be earning coin. this coin. She presses herself right up against you, moving her lips slowly towards your ear. Suddenly, she bites uh. you on the neck viciously. Blood pours from the wound, and she clings to you tightly, lapping, lapping it all up. You're a vampire you black now. Out. When you come to, uh, you see her standing over you. Thanks, she said, and Top tosses you a couple of times. Oh, good job, you got Yay. a point. Feel your neck, you notice the wound has healed completely. Your body feels ice cold. Oh. You can't through charm. Hey, yo, wait, 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 what? Hey, yo, you're a vampire now. The storm arrives in the night. By the morning, it still rages. For three full days, the tempest puts us through a grinder. Drowns us, crushes us, ruins us. But then it ends. We see the graveyard our home has become. Our home. Does anything yet live? Is it? Are we? Past saving? Well, I saved the game just five seconds ago. So um, now check, the, check your stats against everyone else's to make sure whatever you decide. Wait, 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 wait. What? Choose so your role. you have to decide what um, your role will be in the rebuilding of the town. Oh. I guess so that's, that's what your stats you were building for. Oh. Well, I guess, well, I I'm, guess just, I'm the leader because I have the highest charm of everyone. Okay. You can also be the town drunk. Yeah, yeah, that means a lot. Oh. Yeah. No, one, <laughs> no one be the drunk or the uh, the uh, the smuggler or looter because what? those like just ruin the entire thing. Yeah. You take it upon yourself to be the leader of the survivors. You expertly delegate and prioritize tasks. You give motivating speeches and act as an effective mediator in disputes. This helps rebuilding the rebuilding effort significantly. Yay! And then uh, I've been working for this, the uh, charm and the uh, mind and magic, so I'm going to be a conjurer. You take it upon yourself to help conjure up supplies for the town. With your magic, you summon supplies of the highest caliber. With little effort, you are summoning high-quality lumber and food from uh, out of nowhere. This helps the rebuilding effort significantly. You realize all you do is just food. <laughs> yeah, it's like, so I have really balanced trees. stats, but my mind is a little bit uh, higher than the rest. Calendra. All of them are eight except for that. Well, Calendra. you can do whatever you want. Calendra. Um, I'm thinking. Uh, oh, you yeah, have a doctor, yeah. A doctor. Oh yeah. What about uh? Oh yeah, no, no. Daka to Katori. Uh, cause I'm a lady, so I can't be a builder, cause my okay. Okay. uncalloused, be stopped be. hands for... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you can be whatever the hell you want. You also <clears throat> can't be a doctor in that logic. Or a smelter, or a tailor. Town drunk. Upon yourself to help the sick and injured from the yog. Your hair is crazy. <laughs> yeah, it's like, it's like a rat's nest. <laughs> <laughs> you might be able to keep most patients in stable, uh, some are, uh, uh, some are even able to get up back to work in no time. This helps the survival effort quite a bit. God damn it, Obamacare. I can't even choose my doctor anymore. <laughs> What's that? What's that? What's that, Republican? <clears throat> you piece of fuck? Yeah. You piece of shit. Alright. Be the tailor. You should be the builder because you have fitness is 12. Finesse. That's finesse, finesse is 12. It's the physique oh, that you okay. want for the builder. That's why I finesse. said tailor because yeah, that's tailor the only one finesse. I can imagine finesse being useful in. Uh, besides or the builder. Well, you also have 9 physique. Yeah, I also have 9 physique. Dude, you're... But you're like, just, choose whatever you want. Your traits actually match your guy. The... the <laughs> Taylor, the his finesse, I guess would have to be high, right? Everyone would have douche uh, collars. I would, I would, I would reckon finesse and mind for Taylor. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone would have douche collars and be all. I guess it'd be like Mulan. Oh, <laughs> you got the. Oh. You you volunteer to weave and mend clothing for survivors to keep them warm. You grab some fabrics when suddenly your skin turns milky white. Because you're a vampire. You lose three physique. You also notice your teeth are a little sharper than usual. <laughs> Complexion clears up instantly. You th gain three charm. What? You notice another tailor beside you wh whipping. whipping whipping, and sweating his brow. What? His neck's fully exposed. <laughs> you can, you can even see a fan or two. Delicious. <laughs> Before you know it, you're, co you're coated in blood with a mangled form in front of you. There are several people around and they're all... Uh, Filled with delicious nectar. <laughs> <laughs> Next few oh, hours are no. a blur. You wake up to find yourself in the middle of the woods. You don't quite know what happened, but you're pretty sure you didn't help us survive. 
<laughs> and so we set about our tasks once more living our lives. This time in a way we might never have expected or even wanted. But in the end... This is whenever we're going to see what type of ending we got. So... We were defeated. Oh, bad ending. <laughs> Those of us left struggled to put our home to fault. rights. <laughs> but the effort was feeble. Doomed. The city bled survivors, eventually becoming a husk, a dead thing. And perhaps the Yogg was only partly to blame. Now, oh, see, the, human society. The really cool thing about this is that you actually get the back, uh, these stories for everyone else after the Yogg. So, here's... You know, your fault. You know, uh, so I was just uh, looking to make a little bit of money, and, uh, <laughs> and but then uh, you became a then fucking I, vampire, super vampire. Okay, so this is what happened to RJ. With the town in ruins, you decide to flee and go through the woods to seek a new home. This venture is cut short, however, as you are mauled to death by a mysterious beast. <laughs> cool. See, since we got bad endings, we're gonna have bad things for all of us. So that's great. Uh, this should, this one should be for me. It's yeah. Just, <laughs> to dis attempt to distract yourself from the uh, disaster unfolding around you, you try meditation. Oh, you spend weeks at a time sitting in uh, one spot, trying to cross uh, to another <laughs> plane of existence. After years of uh, attempts and self-sacrifice, you finally manage to cross over to the ethereal realm. You come to find that the ethereal realm is exactly <laughs> like the normal world, except everyone's eyes are slightly smaller. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is just, uh, <laughs> just as wrecked and broken as it is over there. You don't uh, know how to get back home. <laughs> what the heck? Their eyes are just slightly, just smaller. slightly smaller. Oh, so this okay, is this is this is awesome. The ruins of the village. You, you're trying to set up uh, some form of infir infirmary to help call the, the rampant disease and uh, running a mock. A mock. A. You try to find helpers, but it appears anyone able has uh, either fled the city or died. With some serious bite marks. <laughs> Either way, you try your best to cure the scores of plagues killing people all over the ruins. Unfortunately, all your con uh, all your contact with various diseases take its toll. You die without saving anyone. <laughs> oh, poor <laughs> so And this is what happens to Max. All right. <clears throat> Under the cover of night, you sneak back into town. You hide in the sewers, constantly craving the taste of blood. And if finding ra rats aren't enough, you take to the surface, preying on victims sleeping in their sh uh, sleeping on the streets. Sometimes they die immediately. <laughs> oh, that's good. Sometimes they get very sick, okay. and sometimes they join you in the sewers, preying on the townspeople alongside you. <clears throat> Before long, you've de developed an, enti an entire underground in civilization. Oh, good. Oh well, good for you. Good Yay. for you. I'm glad. I'm glad someone was yeah. happy. You know what? You know what? I'm good, just gonna say real quick. You fucked If up I was actually over. in that situation, I probably would have actually like killed myself <laughs> as soon as I realized that I killed the first person. <laughs> well, that's you a... fucked everyone over because mm -hmm. you ate like thirty-five people. You did. Yeah. Um. It's it's funny if you they're uh, just all gone. If no. you if you become a vampire and you still have weeks left, the next place that you go, uh, you slaughter everyone in that place and then it's it's uh you can't go there anymore <laughs> no one can. like it, it like if it's in the woods then it's closed off like the woods are and then like if it's if it's the palace then everybody's like evacuated if it's in the slums though then um everyone from the slums uh all the houses and everything are closed down and then they all go to the uh to the gardens and if you meditate you can actually join in their like petition or uh picket like line and stuff for That's the funny. palace it's hilarious you okay you all right. Can Thank we play you. again until we win? Uh, it's, it takes a while. Thank you so much for uh, joining us. I hope you can join us next week when we do it again. Yeah. We're not going to do this again next week. We're not. We're no. totally going to do we this may. again. We week. may. We, we may. We're probably this. not. This was probably a one-time thing. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.